Hello, welcome back. It's, it's, uh, I'm depressed. <laughs> We're about to, uh, finish up this class trial. Uh, Mekon is 110% guilty. Uh, more psych psychosis in there than one would have believed. So, uh, it's time to tear it up. Oh, that's cute. Hajime with all the characters. All right, let's just get back into it. I, I'll keep explaining until you forgive me. That bag is a limited item, but it ain't a limited item. It ain't a limited item, you fucking ass. You pig barf dog. Uh, what time is it? 12.32? Yeah, I think we... I chatted for a long time, so we're in some spot. Okay. Oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> That's why that crime is impossible I forget what she's talking for about. anyone to pull off. This chick, has she lost it for good? Will you forgive me? You'll forgive me, right? Isn't that right? You're obviously gonna forgive me, right? Kind of big, um, big Junko vibes off of her a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. I gotta do something and end this. At this rate, we're not gonna get it anywhere. Is that what he said? Ah, oh, that, that fucking memory. I gotta do something so I can make her admit it! Panic talk action. Pull that hair out, girl. Oh, she... Oh, not good. Bonus prize. There we go. This is the end. This is the end. Monokuma mentioned this earlier. Let's buy one, get one free, baby. Mm. Sorry, I didn't read that out. It, it's, <laughs> sorry, but yeah, he just said Monokuma was like, buy one, get one free, and it's fucking, it's a, it's a classic, a classic move by people. Who are um, selling stuff? Which means it's not impossible to use that bag in two separate places. So please, just stop making desperate excuses. Comic book hype. Why? Por pourquoi? Why can't you forgive me? Why? It seems her desperate struggle is finally coming to an end. Why does everybody always hate me? You should just forgive me already. Mikan. It's already over. After I go over your crime from the beginning and show that you have no arguments left, please just admit it already. In the end, at least let me believe in you. Well, stock one. All right, let's take a look. Uh, I'm gonna run and then. Um... Conference room. She ran. I don't know. That might not be it. Ah, look at that. Okay, 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 okay. We got this stuff. Oh no, Hyoko. Oh, that's too bad. Uh, okay. I think, uh, okay, it's not that. Uh, it looks like that is that. Great. 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 Oh, you go. Dum dum for you, Hiko. Little dum dum. All right. Uh, what do the killers do after the broadcast? Okay. Did they, they take? Oh wait. It, 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 it reads it. Threw off the hemp bag. Oh, okay. That's correct. I'm, I like that they give you the, the voice prompts. When I saw what I saw on the monitor. Oh, it's right there. Fuck. Think it over again, you thick-headed bitch. The video of the broadcast of hanging. That's what you saw on the monitor, of course. Oh man, I was holding on to her not having the bandages on. Um, 
yeet fries into it. <laughs> All right, let's let's two step ladders are different somehow. The killer ripped off the music venues and wallpaper. Yep. Uh huh. Oh yeah, if you watch this on YouTube and you're wondering who I'm talking to, I am playing this on Twitch. You can find me that into the description. Uh and uh yeah, that's that's that. If you're fucking wondering, I'm not just babbling to myself, although that is also something that I, I do fucking do, so the small clue that the killer left, yeah, it's this guy. Here's wow. Happened in this case. We hear we hear baby. Is, is the surveillance camera video that only I saw. That's why I'm going to start with that to unravel the knots of this crime. When I went to the hospital with Mikon this morning, I noticed a specific thing in the lobby. The incoming signal light on the surveillance monitor was blinking ahead of the scheduled time. I'm just gonna do to auto. Put it on auto. Watching this train wreck. Uh, watching my fucking. Watching my shit crumble. When Why? I switched yeah, on the there monitor, we go. What appeared on screen was. A person wearing a hospital gown and a bag on their head about to hang themselves right at that moment. Just gonna click through it. It's taking a weirdly long time. That surveillance camera unit was designed for two way communication with the hospital and the music venue. That's why I thought the signal originated from the music venue. So I immediately headed over there. But that was the killer's trap. In truth, that video was recorded in a different place. The killer brought the music venue camera the night before and made their preparations in advance. And then they filmed that video in the hospital conference room. By doing so, they tried to make me think the incident was happening in real time, when in fact, the crime had already been committed by that point. The person in the footage wearing the bag was actually the killer acting as a fake. Dun dun. I didn't know that, so I went to the music venue and found the hanged body wearing a bag on its head. Oh no. Yeah, and uh seeing the body uh, before me, I panicked and rushed out of there to get the rest of you guys. Yeah, Mikon would have known that um um what's your nuts was but so impressionable. That was also part of the killer's trap. Killer's After trap the conference room. The killer was likely Ooh. watching the music venue from outside. And as mm. if they were switching places with me, they went inside the music venue and began working on their last trick. First, the killer peeled off the wallpaper covering one of the stage pillars, revealing Hyoko's body. When I first arrived and saw the hanged body, I didn't notice anything strange about that pillar. I didn't expect it to be slightly larger from the wallpaper or have Hyoko's body hidden inside. Oh, well, that was the, she said that one line at the beginning and she was like, um, someone, uh, she's, uh, but me kind of so clumsy she couldn't do that, right? She's, yeah, there was that one line at the beginning which she's like, oh, I couldn't imagine, a slow poke like me couldn't imagine doing something so fast. And I was like, ah, oh, that's so fucking, Sus! I was like, motherfucker. Next, the killer destroyed the surveillance camera that was used in the conference room. Mm, she brought it with her, of course. They mixed it with what was left yeah. of the surveillance monitor found at the crime scene. Yeah. The surveillance camera the killer used was originally brought from the music video, but, but when they brought it, they made sure to destroy its monitor beforehand. They wanted to hide the fact that the camera wasn't at the crime scene. In the end, the killer transformed the crime scene into a closed room. They broke one of the drumsticks from the storage room and placed it near the music venue's entrance. However, they did this to mislead us into believing that the music venue was locked from the inside. In actuality, Splorch. the reason the music venue became a closed room was because of the glue. That's, that's strong fucking glue. If you have four fucking the people smashing that shit. Glue and intentionally created a closed room that could be forced open. With that, the killer finished tampering with the crime scene and met up with Fuyuhiko and me. They helped us force open the music venue door, despite the fact that they personally sealed it. And they made us discover not just Ibuki's body, but Hyoko's suddenly present body as well. At the time, they pretended to be surprised, but inside, they were probably relieved that their plan worked out. Some of the clues didn't come up, like the AC temperature and stuff like that. Like they didn't directly come up. We had like, sh I guess that happens with all the with all the. Um, uh, you don't use all the truth bullets, I guess, in every uh, in everyone, don't you? It's fucking because she she turned up. She purposely turned up the AC to say, oh, there's no way I could do it. 
Isn't that right, Mikan? This crime was orchestrated by you, wasn't it? <laughs> you should. You should have confidence. I'm sure your art's good. You gotta fuck. You can fucking do it. Me when the imposter is sus. <laughs> oh, now she's laughing. <sighs> it's been such a long time. This feeling, I know it well. Like the floor is collapsing, like the sky is falling down upon you. Oh my God, is she literally? She's actually ultimate fucking despair, Mikan. It's Juko of the Shima, everybody. <laughs> To you. Uh, Get out of there. Before that, a moment of your time. All right, sure thing, Monokuma. You're always so friendly and sweet to us. I don't see why not. How do how we do? How do we do? Mm -hmm. Okay, good, good, good. Uh huh. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Uh, I think an A plus. <laughs> Obtained coins. Obtained. <laughs> It Am seems your arguments have reached a conclusion. So let's proceed to our regularly um. scheduled voting time. Well, she was gonna she was gonna re reveal some tea. Now then, please pull the lever in front of you and cast your vote. I certainly will. Who will be chosen as the blackened? Oh will you make the right choice like or the dreadfully wrong one? Let's go! then, though it may be obvious at this point. You got it right once again! That's like three in a row! That's right. Well, I mean, Pecos was a little bit, but that was, was a little iffy, according to the fucking if, how, how deep you want to get into that. That's right. The true identity of the horrifying blackhead who killed two girls was Mika and Stubiki! Damn it. You gotta be shitting me. Are you saying Mikan? The one who nursed us back to health was the one who killed them? I won't forgive you. Don't joke around with me, Mikan. Did you lie to us all along? Were you planning to kill them from the start while you were nursing them? <laughs> Don't just laugh. Say something. This is going nowhere. <laughs> What's going on? Th this chick. Hey, hey. This is nothing like Becco. She's actually gone mental. That's all. There's nothing. There's nothing we can do. She's no longer the same person. She's no longer the Mikan Sumiki we knew. Huh? Hey. Based on my predictions, she might have caught it too. Yes! Yeah. She probably had the despair disease, which is the motive for this case. What? Mikan too, would you say? I... No, because I was looking at Mikan for so long. She was the one taking care of me after all. Consciousness kept drifting, but even so, when I did catch a glimpse of her, her expression was full of despair. A despair so devoid of hope that not even a single fragment of it remained. Hold on, did you say Mikan also had the despair disease? Then that means she what? was... Huh? Hajime, has something crossed your mind? My body's heavy. No, not just heavy, it's somewhat soft and really hot. That's right. Mikan felt really hot at that time. Now that I think about it, oh, that must have been a high fever, just like what Ibuki and Akane had. It cannot be. Then, because of that disease, Mikan was... Perhaps? The symptoms that she surely felt must have been deserving of the name. Despair disease. Losing all hope and harboring despair for all hope. Because of the this, that she was likely overcome with despair. See? That's the reason why... She can still laugh in such a hopeless situation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I'll let her handle that one. Jeez. Which means the Mekon standing before us is no longer the ultimate nurse. She's a completely different person now that she's inflicted, inflicted by the despair disease. Isn't that right? She's a human who- human! Holy shit, who deserves to be called the ultimate despair? Ultimate despair? <laughs> I... That's the reason why I cannot forgive this. I mean, killing someone for the sake of despair instead of for the sake of hope. Impossible. There's no way I can forgive uh -huh. that. For the sake of despair? <sighs> huh, that's completely wrong. Huh? Wrong? Wrong? What's wrong? What I did was for the sake of my beloved. Huh? What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> if only they were still alive, they'd be so happy. I know. My beloved <gasps> was the only one. That's right. The only one who... Teru Teru? ...never hated me. They forgave my existence. They forgave me and accepted me. They gave me value. They loved me. I loved them with all my heart, and they returned it in full. This is my reciprocation. <laughs> I understand that I've done something unforgivable. But you know, but you know, but you know, to transcend, to trans, <laughs> to transcend all that is truly love. what love is all about. I don't understand what you're saying literally everyone to nagito like constantly <laughs> you don't understand is it because you don't have anyone to love it's because you're also someone who isn't accepted by anyone <sighs> what a pity i feel sorry for you <gasps> well even if i say this i'm sure nobody here would understand but love is a wonderful thing <sighs> this feeling of freedom when you no when you no longer care about anything <laughs> My beloved and I are the only ones with that thin veil, and I'm just looking out through it. That's why, as long as I am on the inside, no matter how much they tease me, splash me with water, kick me, oh, it's like amazing. nothing matters. I could just die, that's how little it matters. Seriously, she fucking, she sent it, man. Is it Hyoko? She's gonna say Hyoko or something? Who cares about hope or despair? It's love, only love. Nagito. Is this really the despair disease you were talking about? This is... It seems that I was wrong. Not only was she affected by despair... <sighs> you were half right. It's right to say this all, this, that this is all thanks to that disease. Because thanks to that disease, I was able to remember my beloved. Re... <laughs> remember? <laughs> Apparently that's what my symptom was. <laughs> what a wonderful symptom. Which means you had the remembering disease? What? If this means she remembered something and ended up like this... Such despair. Right, you were saying you were like this from the start? Were you like this before you even came to this island? <laughs> Don't get so angry. Well, first of all, the reason I became like this wasn't my fault. It was all your fault, you know? Because it's not like I'm entirely responsible for turning out like this. I'm the person I am today because of many human relationships. So it's everybody's fault that I turned out like this, you see? <laughs> Even so, the current me was most strongly influenced by my beloved's existence. And it was also my beloved who created the me that everyone can't forgive. But my beloved still forgives me and still accepts me. That is the key difference between all of you and my beloved. I what'd you say? Current me is most strongly. Yeah, it was only. It was also my beloved who created the me that everyone can't forgive. Don't fuck with me. Like I said, who the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Oh my God! Are you saying this is Mikan? She's the real Mikan. Mikan, please answer me. Did you really remember? You ended up like this all because you remembered? There's no way I can believe that. There's no way the person you are right now is the real Mekon. <laughs> oh, you still doubt me? Then, to prove I remember, I'll tell you all something nice. It's about the World Ender organization that you all were worrying about. You serious? You know? <laughs> Not no, I just remembered, that's all. 
I knew about it all along. How that horrifying organization known as World Ender is also the organization known as the Future Foundation. Future Foundation? Future. Ah, oh, fuck. I completely forgot. That feels like an eon ago that we fucking... Oh my god, that we found the fucking Hope Speak Academy. That's right. The symbol of the ancient ruined star. That's right. It was the Japanese word for future. Huh. Just what is the Future Foundation? What are they planning? As the name suggests, that organization is the world ender. The Future Foundation is trying to end our world. To put it simply, they're trying to clean the world for themselves. This is bad. <laughs> Not even heck. This is a comic book, you know. <laughs> As part of their plan to end the world, the Future Foundation brought us to this island. <laughs> Isn't that right, Monami? <laughs> eh? Isn't that right? I know it. Monami, Managuma. You're both members of that crazy organization, aren't they? <laughs> Monami and I are members. I am Monokuma! My existence is entirely my own. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Don't laugh. Hey, Mikon, if you really do remember, then you already know, right? You know the true identity of the traitor hanging among us. Pog. <laughs> of course I know that. Let's see. The future foundation lackey that's hiding among you all is... Oh. Oh well, no one really cares about that, don't you think? It's me, isn't it? Of course it? not! <gasps> I hell no! <laughs> we'll find out eventually, so there's no need to be so impatient. I wish you said impatient. Like a nurse, you get it? You get it? You get it? Let's make a crown for me. Make a crown for my good joke. Make a crown for the good joke. You guys get it? That's good. That's good. Uh, so you, you, there's no need to be impatient. Probably when that countdown ends. Countdown? You, you know even about that? I don't know anything. Oh yeah, that's right. There's so much shit in this fucking game. I just keep forgetting. Ah! Oh my god. Oh, well, Sage's designs. Oh shit, it's a double, it's a double entendre. <laughs> Holy shit. Here we fucking go. Oh, well, I already used it. All right, I'll do it for, we, okay, with time, same time, same time. Can't say fucker, I said it there. Can't say fucker shit for five minutes. Uh, and no, I, I don't want to know the the, uh, the identity, but uh, thank you for asking. Just to be safe. Huh? Uh, I have a feeling that's what it is, but who cares about that, you know? I'm trying, wait, what, wait, oh, I'm sorry, what did you say? I don't know. You, you, you don't even know about that? I don't know anything, huh? Wait, what did she say? Um, I have a feeling that's what it is, but who cares about that, you know? I'm drowning in so much love from the bottom of my heart. I just don't care about anyone or anything. That is... <laughs> Mikon, is this really you? I, I won't believe it. There's no way I can believe you were like this all along. Because if that's true, then who's the person we've been spending time with up until now? <laughs> the past. Ba, 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 ba. She didn't exist in the beginning. Oh, I, yeah, no, I tend, I want to watch the anime, 100%. She's just my past self who lost her school memories. What? P past? I love that pop filter. Want to hear the, you, you want to hear what this is like? If we're, all these peas. The past? So sorry, that's awful. Uh, it's just my past self who lost her school memories. <laughs> you guys considering that thing a friend? Oh. <sighs> that doesn't make me happy at all. It just fills me with dismay. You guys accepted my past self, but not my present self. Th that's... Well... Well, that applies to you, to you all as well. Memories of people, memories of events, whatever memory it is, losing memories are... Do you understand? Like losing your personal identity. Memory is the most important component in building a person, don't you think? I, yeah, honestly, I guess. Losing our memories makes us shadows of the past. Don't you think? Hey. I don't know what you're trying to say, but it sounds metal as fuck. In the end, it's all we, it always leads back to that story. That story about our stolen school lives. Hey, hey. So, that was true all along. Our memories were taken away. 
If it wasn't true, we wouldn't be suffering as much. <sighs> well, why don't you just take your sweet time and remember as your own piss? Oh, Mana Kuma. Is it all right for you to start now? Yes, indeed. Punishment time? Oh, did I? I probably, did I probably, you know what? I probably said, I think I said fuck or shit. So I'm just going to restart the clock. I lose track of it. What is it? Mikan. Why is it end like this? This is too pointless. <laughs> Boo. It's the fucking, <laughs> it's the fucking uh, frying pan. Frying pan expert. Hi, how you doing? The ad is a vibe. Shit. Okay. What ad was it? This is. Too much. Now then, I've prepared a very special punishment for the ultimate nurse, Mikan Sumiki. Shit! And I said shit too. <laughs> I restarted it. Uh... <laughs> Crazy short potato. Thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming to check it out. It's a whole family affair now. So it's over. It's over. Do you guys want to know? Um. This is such a specific reference, but in Canada, in Quebec specifically, there's this comedy show um, called um, Just for Laughs, and uh, they had, that was like actual stand-up comedians at the Just for Laughs, it was a festival, but they had a show called Just for Laughs Gags, and it still runs for some some reason. Um, and it's gags that took place, like, like you can see people with like Nokia's like walking around. It's like, it's it's gotta be at least, at least like 25 years old now. But um, at the end, they all there's this little gremlin that walks out onto this. All the people are like, oh, it's like it's like a perspective of like an actor on a stage looking out a theater, and there's all these people on the stage, and they're all like, blah, 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 blah. and they um they they all walk away, and this gremlin comes out, and he's like, mommy, it's over, and it's the best. Mm, it's so good, it's so good, and then whenever I read, it's over, it's all like that. Um, anyway, um, get ready. Bronus. Uh, my favorite characters. Um, Mikon. Mikon was one of my favorite characters. So, <laughs> and then Chiaki. Honestly, uh, I'd say my favorite character is Mikon Chiaki. Mikon Chiaki. <sighs> is there anyone else I really like? Gundam. Gundam's a good guy. I all like. I like all the characters though. Abuki was actually. Uh, Amuki was actually. A, uh, she was. Um, I. I. Oh, she was. I didn't think any of the characters were bad, but I was like. I was like, um, no idea what I'm trying to say. No idea at all. No idea. But Chiaki, Gundam, and Mikan. So, I guess it's just Chiaki and Gundam. Now I can go to my beloved, who always forgives me. I can finally see them. I'm so excited. Please forgive me, the one who's going to die with the hope of finally seeing you. <laughs> Let's give it up! Punishment time! I was gonna get cut out on YouTube, so you're you're you guys are this is exclusive content. It just it always censors this. Yeah, <laughs> at least sixty six percent. Bye bye ouchies. Oh, that's the worst foot noise I've ever heard in my life. The walls fall down. Interesting. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry. Do you ever find out who the dad is? Fat ass, that fan service. Mm. That thick, mm. thick Monoku uh, Monokuma stuff. Yeah, she gets sent to the moon. Maybe she survives. Who knows? I don't know. Probably. Probably. She fucking, she fucking does it. It's a vibe, man. Oh shit. I just, <laughs> if you want, people on YouTube. I don't have the chat on right now on YouTube. Uh, <laughs> it's just gonna be me. It's not gonna make any sense. It's finished. El finito. The finish, no. Is it really finished? That's true, honestly. It's not as crazy as I thought. I thought she was gonna I thought I knew there's gonna be a needle involved. Because excuse me is very disappointing. I knew that uh I knew that um 
a needle was going to be involved. Um, but I didn't, well, I didn't know, but I was like, I was like guessing. I was like, it's her whole thing. You know what I mean? The killer who killed Ibuki Miyoda and Hiyoko Sayonji was Mikan Sumiki. And she's been executed. She apparently committed her crime because she was afflicted by the despair disease. <laughs> so what? What's finished? Nobody wanted it to end this way. Let me ask. Who was that Mikan from earlier? Was that her true form? Or is that itself a symptom of the despair disease? Damn it. It doesn't matter either way. If she ended up like that just from remembering. Then all along, Mikan was never worth being a symbol of hope. God. Damn. Nagito's fucking... <laughs> He's fucked. Hot take. Nagito's kind of fucked up. <laughs> even if her words were influence. Even if... Uh... Oh my god. Aw, uh, did I... I probably said fuck that entire time. Oh my god, I keep forgetting about that. All right, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Is this, does this even have a point if I keep forgetting? I'm gonna hold it in my hand. I'm gonna hold it in my hand. Ibuki <laughs> Mio dead. <laughs> even if her words were influenced by the despair disease, if the disease tear turned her into that, if she lost herself to a simple disease, she was definitely unworthy of being a symbol of hope. Could she have been a drum of hope? Isn't that right? So let's just move on. <laughs> Come on, let's take all this despair and change it into hope. Set, set impossible. Impossible. I mean, I thought we were friends this. <laughs> I thought I thought we were friends this whole time, but even so, like a house of cards collapsing in an instant. In the end, a friend we thought we knew ended up showing us a completely different side of herself. Then she vanished from our sight, leaving behind only her malice towards us. And now, there's no way we can just move on or try to have a clear-cut, a clear-cut attitude about these feelings. That's clearly impossible. Damn it! It would have been so much easier if she was the traitor, too. I think you mean, huh, imposter? <gasps> Boom! Wrong! Too bad, that's not the case. Mikan was not the traitor. Come on! The traitor is still alive. As proof, see how fine Monami looks right now. I'm not fine at all. Mm -hmm. But if the traitor died, he wouldn't be this calm, right? I mean, you're both pawns of the future foundation. So you guys are like two hearts beating as one, right? You fiend. What does that make you fiend? You did say that you're different than Monomi. Phew. Who cares about who I am? More importantly, I'm tired. Relatable. Oh my god. The drama just kept going and going. I didn't have time to eat my black bean right... My black bean right eye. Oh my god, I didn't even have time to eat my black bean right eye during the break. Hey. Your right eye is made out of black beans? Hey, hey. Wait, now's not the time to focus on that. What are you trying to say? Hey, um... You know, it isn't hard that life has... Isn't it hard said that life has its ups and downs? It's fun because downs come after ups. But if life was full of downs, wouldn't it get boring? <laughs> so, in order to help you guys feel better, I prepared a special event. Special event? <laughs> Head over to the first island's beach. An old friend will be waiting there. Old friend? Huh? Could it be? Nekomaru? Hey. Is it? Is It is, isn't it? Nekomaru was safe after mm. all. Um, safe. How should I say this? Hmm. I knew it. I knew that crazy... I knew that crazy bastard Nekomaru would come back to us in one piece. He's a robot now. I'm gonna guess he's a <laughs> robot. Awesome. We're starting to see the light of hope. Yeah, who's Mikan? Whatever, forget about her. The light of hope. Um, I am happy Nekomaru is China, Josh. But, but I... So just as I thought. Three of our friends just died. So I honestly cannot be happy. Hmm. <laughs> Miss Sonia. However. However. <laughs> even so, I am still happy. If Nakamaru is safe, I am truly happy. Fine. <laughs> oh, really? Shit, I'm excited. I'm excited to see it. Well, if you are happy, 
you should honestly greet you with open arms. When you do Monokuma's voice, Corey Aiko. Monokuma! Uh, perhaps those, uh, perhaps those who have been taken from us would do the same if they still lived. Huh. Dinner. <laughs> ho, 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 ho! Hey, Supreme Overlord of who gives a shit? That line doesn't suit you at all. Silence. I shall crush you into dust. Um. Hey, Pookie, the Oko, me gone. Can you hear us? If you are unhappy, I apologize. However, please, forgive me for right now. I, I want to warmly welcome Nekomaru when he turns to us, when he returns to us. You don't have to worry, Sonya. I'm sure your feelings are reaching them. Really nice job on that accent, right? by the way. Then let's all go greet Nekomaru. Let's make it grand, even for those who have died. <laughs> Huh? What the heck? Do I still have the effects of that disease? I don't get this at all. Akane. Alright! Then let's go. Literally everyone's just like, alright, whatever. Alright, timer's up. I can fucking shit again. Pissers. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck is this fucking... What the fuck? <laughs> Mikan just fucking says like, Oh, I know who the traitor is. I murdered those people because I wanted to. What a ho hopeless end, and everyone's <laughs> literally, literally, everyone's like, Man, that's <laughs> it was, everyone's like, Yeah, that's rough, buddy. Anyway, Nekomaru's back to normal, so let's go check him out. Oh, yeah, you're right. Let's forget about this stupid fucking meek on bitch. Nekomaru's coming back when we heard that. <laughs> anyway. Oh no! Anyway, we were unable to contain our excitement as we jumped into the elevator. I can hardly contain my excitement. I have you too. Uh -oh. Man, they just ran off without listening to what I had to say. Jeez, they're so impatient. Didn't they learn to stick around until others have finished talking? Um, what does that mean? Yeah, Nekomaru's some sort of freak now. You, you're plotting something again, aren't you? No way! <laughs> I'm not plotting anything. I was just trying to properly explain everything to them, including Nekomaru's body. <gasps> oh. Nekomaru's body? <laughs> it's their fault for not sticking around until I finish fucking speaking. <laughs> so if something happens because of that, I bear no responsibility. I bear no responsibility. <gasps> you, what did you do to Nekomaru? What's this? Nekomaru. Escapism is real. We did it. We did it, guys. What did I do? I just saved them. That's all. I mean, if I didn't do that, there's no way I could have saved someone who was that close to death. So it just couldn't be helped. <laughs> <laughs> Italian machine gun fire in the Swiss Alps in 1945. <laughs> they weren't fighting in 1945. As soon as we exit the elevator, we started running. Hurry! To the bitch on the first island! Right. <laughs> Let's haul ass! And with that, Akane picked up her butt cheeks with her own hands and fucking sprinted! Even though our minds were completely exhausted. Strangely enough, our bodies felt light. Without stopping for anything, we kept on- we kept- We kept right on running toward the beach on the first island. Cheeks clapping in the wind. Where? Where in the world is Nekomaru? Hey. Where in the world is Carmen Sandomaru? Hey, Nekomaru, show yourself. We've gone to pick you up. Please hurry and come out of hiding. We raised our voices. Uh... We looked around the area. We raised our voices again. Oh, is he the... Is he the... <laughs> we looked around the area again. Hmm. Getting a trend and so on and so forth. We kept looking for him. But... Hole. Hey, hey. Not either hell, man. He's nowhere to be found. Damn it. Could it be? Did we, start, did we get false info for Monokuma again? That's <laughs> when it happened. We heard a familiar voice echo threat the bitch. <laughs> what happened? Were y'all looking for me? Aw, oh, I'm, so, I'm sure he's going to be completely normal. Could it be? That, that voice. Um, With high hopes in our hearts, we turned down. Toward the direction... Oh, oh, no, that's not it at all. With high hopes in our hearts, we turned toward the direction of the voice. And then... We saw something truly unbelievable. 
I knew it. Robo. Robo Maru. Did he still have to shit himself? Uh, what the? Yo! I've kept you waiting. Hey, what's going on? Mm, I know. Hyoko. Yeah, Hyoko dying. I, I was saying that earlier when Hyoko was on the way up and then she dies in the fucking next chapter. It's kind of like she got denied some... Uh, someone was saying, I'm sad that she didn't get more development. I, Hyoko wasn't my favorite character, so I was okay with it. But like, yeah, it's kind of... Um, Cut short. Perhaps you don't remember my face since we haven't seen each other in a while. That was like a Mahiru's death, actually. I didn't expect that coming. I thought there was going to be more. I thought there was going to be more. That's pretty sad, you know? That's too much. <laughs> <laughs> I'm depressed. <laughs> I'm alone. <laughs> I'll never be able to feel the touch of human warmth on my skin again. <laughs> um, who are you? Huh? You too? What's going on? Oh my god, does he have a different face? If you're messing with me, I'll stop doing it to you. Um, Nekomaru, haven't you noticed it yourself? What do you mean, noticed? Oh, you mean this body? <laughs> this is nothing! If he doesn't have a cybotic, if he doesn't have a robotic eye, I'm gonna be so mad. Oh. The name's Nekomaru Nidai! I've been reborn in the rivers of hell! <laughs> oh shit, I'm just the first time I meet someone, that's what I'm doing. I'm an age shiny doorknob, I've been reborn in the rivers of hell. Look at it go, I gotta get a screenshot of that, it's fucking lit. Fantastic. Uh oh. What's going on? How many days we got left? It's eight. Oh, nine days left. Come to belongs to hell. He owns it. Is it only? Why did it say? It said fourteen thirty four. Trapped by the ocean scent. I don't know. Damn, got a little fucked up that time. Got a little fucked up. To be continued. What you gonna do? What you gonna fucking do there, kiddos? Nice. Is it medicine or social skill? Is it a nurse's apron? Apron. Apron. Would you like to save it? Would you like to save your fucking... You, dad, you guys definitely fucking heard that one. That was fucking ripidly. I know. Nekomaru. King of shit. Where we were hoping things would progress smoothly. That's right. A common... Ordinary progression would have just been fine. Been just fine. Like, for example, the enemy's lair crumbling right after you defeat the final boss or your dead friend suddenly reappearing. It would have been just fine if things had progressed like that. That's the kind of old school progression we were hoping for. Not this unreasonable turn of events. The name's Nekomaru Nidai. I've been reborn in the rivers of hell. N Nekomaru? Is that you? <laughs> no matter how you look at it, I'm still me. No matter how we look at it, this isn't you at all. Jeez. Robo Neko. Jeez. You guys are a strange lot. You all have such big, wide eyes. <laughs> oh, perhaps you've all fallen in love with this metallic body of mine. <laughs> oh, the, the organic mouth is awful. Is so fucking cursed. I already know what you want to say just by looking at your eyes. Then again, I am a former team manager. Kia! What happened? You look like you've seen a ghost or something. Hey man, don't go scaring Miss Sonya with that strange ass mask. Oh. Cause. I got news to break to you, sweetheart. I got big fucking news to break to you. As he raised his stammering voice, Kazuchi grabbed him Nekomaru's head and... I already know! Come on! <laughs> that is very in line for something for Kazuchi to say. Come on, take it off! Ow, 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 ow! St stop it! Stop it! Hey, hey! Oh yeah, no, you're good. We're back to fucking and shitting. <laughs> what, what, what's you good to come off? Wait, what? Are you freaking kidding me? Holy crap! It's not just for show! 
Electricity! It's not just for show. It's pure electricity. He did that better. I've been born as pure electricity. <laughs> Ga ha 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 ha. Oh, if you're seriously you Nikomaru, it. that's my fault, right? You ended up getting a body like that, and it's all my fault, right? Sorry. Nikomaru, I, I don't know how to apologize for this. <laughs> don't worry about it. A lot of stuff happens when you're alive. You serious? You're too a beast. Is this really okay? <laughs> if you keep sweating the small stuff, you're gonna end up getting more gray hairs. Hey, hey. God, I'm every little thing he does is a waste of time. Uh, hey. But, but you're really Nekomaru, right? You came back for us, right? That's right! I'm resurrected from the depths of hell in shining silver! How you... are you even okay with that? It doesn't even compare to my eye patch. Yeah, there's more maimings in this game, 110%. How can you accept that body? <gasps> It's better to just be alive. Huh? huh? It's better to just be alive. Hey, don't you agree? If I'm alive, I can still talk to you all. If I'm alive, I can still fight. Show some spirit! It doesn't matter what happens to my body. Not one bit! Amazing! You're amazing. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh. whoa. Nagito, standing up. Uh, Nekomaru's brimming with hope. It's better to just be alive. I do understand what Nekomaru's saying, but no matter how we make sense of this, it's just too weird. This isn't a novel or a movie. This is reality. <laughs> I can't wait. I want, a four, I want that fat fourth wall break. Can something this unexplainable really be allowed to happen? No, instead. Why did this happen? Um, anyway, um, I'm glad. That's fine, right? Right? Nekomaru definitely came back to us. What's this? My, my, am I interrupting you? Touching me, Union. Ho wa wa wa! Why is Nick Maru Hey! Um... Unfortunately, it was truly difficult to save Mecho. Mecho Naru? No, Neko Maru from the jaws of death. But they don't call me the Psycho Pop Magician for nothing. I fucking bet they don't. Oh my goodness! Such, Such a, a wonderful before and after has occurred! Has occurred. It appears to be a little too traumatic. Thanks to that, I'm getting stabbed by all these en envious stares. Hey, hey. If you're a robot, what's going on with your thought process? Is that a program too? Then what happened to the other stuff, like your self-awareness and... How many times do I have to tell you that it doesn't matter? No matter what shape or form I take. Je suis Nekomar Nidai. Is he? Is he going to power through the rest of his life with his new abilities? Mm. That, that kind of reaction. Looks like you really are self-aware. <gasps> that means this technology is insane. I've never seen or heard of anything like this before. <laughs> Who was Mikan? Who was she? Did she just die? Who fucking cares? <laughs> Nekomaru's back. <laughs> when the commoner considers uh, advance, it's not much of an advancement. Uh, if you think advancements exist in colleges and laboratories, that's a huge misunderstanding. <laughs> The real advancements exist in the place where you can pass on that talent. Uh. Oh my god. Dream CMP is really weird. What is Dream CMP? Uh. Hey, hey. Are you saying that that's you? Were you really that amazing? You. Stop admiring him. You stupid stuffed toy. Don't go strewing with people's bodies like that. Huh? Oh, hold on. If you harm Monokuma, you're going to... You intend to defy me yet again? You're quite the barbarian. Disappear! Mmm. This one stream you fucked. Dream see SMP is a Minecraft roleplay server. I see. You gotta keep up. Gotta keep up on the, the news and your Dream CMP uh, Minecraft server. Jeez, this time you'll definitely fall prey to my Monokuma Zuka. He said Monokuma Bazooka, but Monokuma Zuka, come on, man. That's a missed opportunity. Ha! Ah! Ah! Oh. They call him the bulge blocker. Once again, the world shook and turned stark white, as if the surrounding environment and all sound was blown away by the impact, <sighs> turning everything completely white. And within that whiteness, I heard that voice yet again. Mukuro Ikusaba. Ah, ah, Nekomaru. Do we really need that? Damn. <laughs> that didn't face me at all. Check it out! I'm intact! I have no injuries at all! Hey, hey! 
Are you fucking serious? He took that blast and doesn't have a single scratch. <sighs> awesome. He's seriously a real robot. Hey, can you let me disassemble you? Can you let me disassemble you and show me your insides? No! Next murder is definitely... <laughs> This fucking energy, dude. If I get disassembled, I'll end up fucking dying. By the way, ah, I suppose I should fill you in. Sounds good, Sage. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate it. And thank you. Thank you, guys. You have a good rest of your day, okay? See you later. Good luck on, on your chapter. Even though he's a robot now, if Nekomaru is killed, it's still going to count as a murder, okay? Of course. It's possible that Nekomaru might kill someone instead. <laughs> Don't say such foolish things. That will never happen. <laughs> well, with all that mind, you guys enjoy the killing school trip together. Wow. Once again, I hope we can all get along. It's, it's gonna be a while before I can mentally process uh, this. Um, will Nakamaru never return to his original form? If that is the case, it is a burden for Nakamaru. Jeez. Hey. Hey, hey. It's not like I can come back as a monster. I'm just a robot now, you know? I'm sorry. I can't really see a difference. Uh -huh. Well, just consider this a little promotion. By making a robot one of the main characters, a genuine mystery is transformed into a sci-fi mystery. <sighs> and the hard-boiled is transformed into cyberpunk. Hey. This, it, it, I was about to say this game makes so many references ahead of its time. I'm like, uh, they're literally just words. Saying Among Us is not an Among Us reference. And saying Cyberpunk is not a fucking Cyberpunk reference. You're totally destroying the shot, yes. Oh, well, who cares? As long as it's fun, it's totally fine. Oh. Uh... Oh my god, he's, he's fucking chunky. I listened to Monokuma's boisterous laugh. Once again, I was forced to accept. This island is not the day-to-day -day world I know. It's a mad world. Mad world. Where the strange is accepted as normal. Causes, reasoning, circumstances, foreshadowing. These things don't apply here at all. That's what it le means to live. In a... Doom, 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 doom. Oh, you get an amusement park. Do ultimate robots dream of... Do electric sheep dream... Do elect... What is it? Is it... Do cyborgs dream of electric sheep? It's fucking... It is... <laughs> it is kind of... That's actually a cyber... I guess it is a sci-fi... What is that? Sci-fi mystery? Cyberpunk mystery? Blade Runner? Next morning, we gather at the hotel restaurant like we always do. <laughs> Today was awesome as usual. <laughs> as always, you sure do eat a lot. I feel relaxed just by looking at you. It's impossible not to worry about it. No matter what, this feels really strange. It's not something I'll get used to easily. Hey. Anyway, what are you gonna do, Me Mecha Mecha Maru? Mecha Maru, you're used to him already. What am I going to do for food? Do you need like oil? Hey, hey. Regular preview. <laughs> Nah, he doesn't need oil. Since he said he's pure electricity, maybe he's battery powered or something. I can totally eat normal food, especially rice dishes. I can't keep my eyes off them. <laughs> However, he's sweating. The robot is sweating. I've been feeling a little down today, so I don't have much of an appetite. All right. Are you not functioning? If you show me your insides, I can fix you up, you know. <sighs> no means no! <laughs> <laughs> What? So you're here too? Sorry. Ah, sorry for being here. I should know my place and not speak out of turn when everyone's gathered together like this. Laughs. Ah, sorry. I should know my place for being such a piece of garbage. However, I just want to make sure I spoke to you about what happened yesterday. What happened yesterday? Mm. That person, Mikan called her beloved. I can't help thinking about that, and it won't get out of my head. What? Hmm? Am I just a coward for worrying about that? Let me tell you It this. crossed my mind as well, but based on how she phrased it. So? This is the end. This is really... Now I can go to my beloved and be forgiven. I can finally see my beloved. Please forgive me, as my hopes of finally seeing you die with me. 
This too it was must be the will of causality. As if she was speaking to an entity that does not exist in this world. Oh, oh, There's nothing to worry about. More importantly, we should be thinking about the future foundation, our enemy. If that fearsome organization, also known also as World Ender, is truly responsible for our imprisonment, you will die. Then investigating who's behind that organization is our top priority. The Future Foundation. Hmm. That word, future. We don't have one. <laughs> Mikan doesn't. Ooh. Does it have anything to do with that ancient ruin? I mean, there's no doubt that this, that, that symbol on the door to the ancient ruin was the Japanese word for future. Future. If that's the case, it might be better if we investigate the ancient ruins again later. However... Nah, I'm gonna ignore that. The more I think... Oh, pardon me, wrong accent. However, the more I think about it, the less it makes, the less sense it makes. Why would an organization that's secretly brought in to end the world make us suffer like this? They went to a lot of trouble to abduct us and bring us to this island. Mm. Not only that, they took away several years worth of memories of our lives at... Hoops Peak Academy. Um, they went to uh, a lot of trouble to abduct us and bring us to this island. Why would an organization that's secretly funny? Yeah, make us suffer like this. I mean, ending the world is kind of a suffering thing to do, so I, I'm not. It's not too much of a stretch there, Sonya. You dumb bit. Just kidding, bros. For reasons that are also unknown. Future Foundation World Ender. Ha! There's obviously something wrong with you if you believe something is something so unrealistic. You're on the talk. What, sh what we should be most concerned about as it relates to the Future Foundation is right? the traitor from the Future Foundation that's hiding among us, Pog. Hey. I wonder who it is. The true identity of the outsider hanging among us, Pog, and trying to ensnare us, Pog. Oh. I won't be fooled. I tried to wink. I just blinked at the camera. Nagito is obviously the most suspicious, though. Even a childish organization blathering about ending the world wouldn't accept someone like me. Man, nobody wants a worthless human like me to join their group. <laughs> you guys should know that feeling well, right? Yeah, I do. Oh, yeah. You think so? And that's the reason why you're not the traitor? I don't understand your theory at all. Huh? Then who do you think is the most suspicious? It's obvious. I nominate Hanji, man. Honestly, I nominate myself, too. I, what is my past? Answer that, Hajime. Hajime Defenders. The average Hajime Defender versus the Chad Nagito Believer. Huh? Well, Isn't it normal to doubt the most likely candidate? Isn't it normal to doubt the Manchurian candidate? Hey. Not just that. You're the, one who, who, you, you're the only one here who still doesn't know what the ultimate talent, what ultimate talent you possess. If we're basing this on an outsider hiding, hiding among a group close of ultimates, Hajime should be doubted right away. And Hajime's a traitor? Yeah, slice me open. Uh, of course not. What are you even like saying? You shouldn't raise your voice like that. We might become more suspicious of you, you know? <laughs> Shark fin hair sus. Saw him then. Th this is obviously your fault. I can't wait when someone's like, what, like three years from now watching this series and like, they're like, what the fuck are they? Like, they're, you can just absolutely how dated this video will be based on all the Among Us references. So I apologize for that now. Stop fighting. Oh, sorry. Stop fighting. Dude, don't you like fighting with ourselves like this is Monokuma's trap? That, that might be true, but... All right. I'll handle this. Just leave this matter to me. I think Nekomaru's gonna die. What do you mean? Um, um, um. To eliminate this tense atmosphere, allow me to present you my new function that I discovered last night. Oh my god. Whew. I tried to blow past that yawn, but she, she, fought, she fought through him. No function. Don't tell me. Is it flight? C can you fly? It's not a conventional function like that. It's far more practical and novel. We just play his music. Now then, let's go! Whoa! Behold! Nekimaru is crying! Hardly. I'm not crying. My right eye dispenses cola, and my left eye dispenses rooibos tea. I gotta check if I'm saying that right. Rooibos. Let's say it slow. Rooibos. Rooibos. Roy Bose. 
Roybos. Roybos. Nani, are you? A soda fountain? I know we'll be here all day if we keep commenting on every little thing you do. Fuck with me. But what the hell was Monica with thinking giving you a function like that? You are so evil. That guy, he's definitely fooling around. Monokuma's just toying with other people's bodies. I, too, was modified by Monokuma, so I totally understand how Nekomaru feels. I dispense cream soda. But don't be depressed. You'll get used to it. It's surprising how quickly you'll get used to it. Don't go button in our conversation all of a sudden. I'll kill you until you die from it, you stupid rabbit. Leave my queen alone. That's right. You thought Mekon... You thought I was on the Mekon train, but no! It was Monobay the whole time. Virgil knows. Virgil. You know. An extremely violent thing to say to someone. <laughs> you showing up at this time means... Did you come to tell us that you defeated another Mono Beast? Ta-da! You're correct! <laughs> Once again, you can visit a new island, so please take this opportunity to get along with everyone. Where are you going? What a drag. <laughs> eh? If we go to the new island, it's like we're gonna find a way to escape this place, huh? Escape this place, right? That's the spirit, you boy. That's right. spirit, cause. Brother, I think we show the opportunity to kill increases every time we go to a new island. So, it might be best if we do not go. Eh? Huh? I renounce you! I don't know what you're planning, fiend, but we're not going to fall for what? it. Th that's a, a misunderstanding. Uh, I was just. Lame! Ah, jeez, how annoying! Just stay back and leave the rest to your big brother. I'll give you an example of how to lure these guys to you, little sis. What Nani are you doing? You're acting like we're allies or something. Oh my, oh. D, 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 I tell you to stay back. D, D, delicious. Okay. This technique, it's impossible to defend against it or evade. Well now. Huh. There. Now that I've mopped up the annoying Special one. Special bleeding service. Okay. Since you guys are feeling down in the dumps, I'll make you guys so excited your noses will bleed. Compared to the earlier investigations, I've prepared a special treat that's completely different than before. Um, treat? Nice. Oh, you took the bait? I guess it's true. If you want to get a shut in under the room, carrots are the best. Huh? Who the fuck cares about carrot? Who, who the fuck carrots about? I mean, shit, who the fuck cares about that? Hurry up and tell us what the treat is. <laughs> uh, it's an amazing treat. It's an amazing tea. It's a big fat fucking milker hanging out of the sky. Don't piss your pants. Well, it's okay if you do. Just don't spray it on me. I prepared a bunch of stuff you guys might find interesting on the new island. Such as clues about the future foundation. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Nagito starts licking his lips. <laughs> I keep leaning to the left, apparently. That's fine. There you go, that works. Okay. What is this? Mr. Monokuma. Yeah, I like this theme. Such as parts that may be useful for making a ship. You serious? Are you for real? News. And also, your student profiles from your time at Hope Speak Academy. Huh? So do your best to explore. Take care. Uh, hey, hey. What should we do? You know, right? Our, our only option is to go, obviously. We might be able to go home if we have ship parts. Yep. I plan to go too. If there are clues about the future. We need to make sure we go see them and see them. Hajime. What about you, Hajime? Of course you're going, right? If you look at your student profile, you might be able to find out what your shining tit is talent is. <laughs> It's a chance for you to clear up any suspicions, right? What suspicions? I don't think there are. I don't think anyone here doubts me. I think a lot of people doubt you. You didn't refute that it could be you. What? Huh. I see. U P. I should just end it there. I should just cut it there. But if there's a clue about my talent, I want to know what it is. The reason Hope Speak Academy chose me. The talent I possess or don't possess, ultimate average student, these things matter to me. There's no way I'm not worried about it. Seems well, I can't do this voice. I'm so sorry. It, it's it's fucking me up. I, I I will get back to it, but I'm I'm losing my energy. 
It seems you've all prepared yourselves for the worst. Starting to get pumped up. That means we're gonna go, right? I... If everyone is going, I shall accompany you as well. Hmm. But there's also a possibility that Monokuma set a trap. We should be careful where we step. I've stepped on a landmine before. Back in Nam, I can't stop thinking about that ancient ruin that might hold clues about the future foundation. We should start exploring the new island. Fuck off, I'm going to that fucking thing. All right, well, this is actually a very healthy spot to end it off. It's no big, you know, like a, a, a healthy amount of cliffhangers, so that's good. But uh, anyways, not to drag on. Uh, if you're liking the series, I'm fucking glad that you are because I'm having a good time playing it and uh, I, I appreciate you checking it out. Because it means a lot when I see those views on my videos. It really does, uh, seeing the, seeing all that, seeing, knowing some people are going through it. So thank you very much. Uh, I'll see you later. Oh, no. Wait, no, it's not save. I want to alt tab. I'll see you later. <laughs> but fucking bye, baby boy.